Good morning, everybody. It's a uh, special weekend. We are going to celebrate our wedding anniversary. If you uh, if you follow us regularly, you remember that um, last Tuesday was our wedding anniversary. Uh, because, but we're adults with babies now, so we celebrate it <laughs> on the weekends when we can get babysitters and actually spend a little bit of time out. So we have a fun evening planned. Uh, it's super windy outside right now, so and I think it's supposed to last all day. So there won't be any Christmas outdoor Christmas decorating going on today. That's going to happen tomorrow. So stick around. We've got a fun weekend planned. start crying when I film. Hi. Are you the sweetest? Are you not watching Horton? Do you want to go get some breakfast? You won't get any, but we're going to go get some breakfast. You can sit there. Does that, does that sound like fun to you? I'll take that as a yes. All right, we're on our way to get some breakfast. I think Gabriel's gonna get some bacon. <laughs> Maybe some pancakes. Yeah, we'll see. No bacon for this kid today. Sorry for the terrible light. Um, so we didn't really film anything during the day because we didn't really do anything during the day. But um, now we're headed to the ballet. Sarah, looking beautiful as always. All right, we're going to the ballet. Well, it is 7.15. The ballet starts at seven. Uh, this is going about as terribly as you could expect in terms of traffic. It, it's almost as if SMU has never had a, a large event on their campus before. So, we, Waze took us around so that we circled in front of the auditorium that the uh, ballet was in. And I dropped Sarah off so she could go ahead and get in and get to the, the ballet. And I'm parking the car somewhere else there's the police showed up after we'd been sitting in traffic for a while and started making an attempt at directing traffic but um we're really not going anywhere fast i'm on the other side of the building i don't even know what's going on so anyway uh, i think this is public parking that i don't have cash for so yay anniversary date okay they take cards so uh, I parked like a mile away from the venue, so gotta go, gotta walk to the thing. The ballet is over, and now we get to take our picture with a ballerina. Because <laughs> I know how to make my wife happy. <laughs> Pretty Sarah. <laughs> On the pretty, pretty campus. 
What? Why you keep getting in the video? Why am I supposed to be in the shot? You're not supposed to be in the shot. I was trying to get a scenery shot. But I look really pretty today. <laughs> I looked so terrible earlier. I need YouTube to know how pretty I look tonight. <laughs> YouTube knows you're pretty. Sarah's taking off her shoes already. So, so when I was pregnant, my feet went up two sizes and they did not go down two sizes. So all my shoes are beautiful, but too small. And when I was pregnant, my <laughs> pants sizes all went up two sizes, but didn't go back to normal. So now all my pants are too small. That's not true. I've worked from home for like five years now and haven't had a real occasion to dress up. <laughs> so most of my pants don't fit. <laughs> anyway, I got to see three quarters of a uh, Nutcracker ballet. That was really nice. Sarah saw more of it than I did. It was pretty good. It wasn't bad. Um, Russian. It was different than your regular old Nutcracker. Yeah, yeah. That it, it was pretty interesting. And it wasn't. It wasn't like I mean the Sugar Plum Fairy, the Sugar Plum Fairy dance. She didn't come out. With the big dress and all the little kids come running out from underneath. That's not the sugar plum fairy that does that. That's somebody else that does that. Anyway. We're going to Google it when we get home to find out who's right. But for now, we're going to try and find like an in and out burger or something so we can have dinner <laughs> in our fancy clothes. Because that's what we do. Because we're extra. Yeah. And we got to take a picture with a ballerina. Woo! I've met someone from the Moscow Ballet. Woo! She put her hand on my head. Did she really? She touched you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, look at him, wouldn't you? <laughs> Good Sunday morning, everybody. It's time to finish putting up the Christmas. That means I'm putting up outdoor Christmas today. Sarah's gonna do the mantle, and then we'll put out whatever random little things we happen to uncover while we're unpacking all that stuff. So here we go. I am not looking forward to figuring that out. All right, progress report. Lights you can't see right now are in the bushes. That little metal penguin is up. And then our what we call our pooping moose, because he's, he's actually skiing, but it definitely looks like he's squatting. And then more lights in the bushes. I had some issues with some burned out lights I had to figure out, and then the Saints game went and got awesome. So eight straight wins, baby. So uh, I've, had, I've had a number of interruptions and it's taken me considerably longer to do this than I wanted it to. So now I'm up on the roof, I'm going up on the roof to, to put up the, uh, the lights I was not looking forward to sorting, which they're still in a big wad. Done, well, untangling. We had a real Griswold situation on our hands. I gotta clip these in, but I got it done. And I'm on the roof again. All the lights are in, but Sarah likes them to be straight. See that? That's not straight. So now I gotta stand at the end of one gutter, identify which ones need to be straightened out, and straighten them out. Whatever makes her happy. Still can't quite see the lights. Obviously it's daytime, but it's done. So this is what we call our menagerie. We have our sledding penguin, our hipster chick, hedgehog, Christmas pig, and you've already met the pooping moose. You getting a bath? <laughs> oh, 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 it's going in the water. <laughs> it's going in the water. I'm sorry. I'll tilt it up so he looks up. Look up. Sleepy baby. I know. I got water in your eyes. Yeah. Little crab. I cover you this little crab up. We gotta get this crab wrapped up. Alright, Gabriel, tell everybody good night. Say good night. No crab. <laughs> And here it is at night. Okay, you saw the outside, and then this is what Sarah did. She replaced that ribbon to make it match the mantle. 
as she did. So now our fireplace is very festive. Okay, we had a real busy weekend, so the ballet ended up being, it was enjoyable, aside from the parking and traffic fiasco. Uh, and then today we got all the decorating pretty much finished. There's a couple of things just kind of lingering out there to take care of. But I'm going to let you guys go because I am about to make some candied pecans for a candied pecan pie that I'm making for Sarah's um, office Thanksgiving feast tomorrow. So the pecans take an hour to make and the pie takes however long after that. So I've kind of got a late night ahead of me and I'm gonna try to get this thing edited so that it'll be ready for you guys in the morning. So hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, give us a thumbs up, um, leave us a comment, tell us what you think and be sure to subscribe to our channel, click that bell so you get the notifications. Appreciate y'all watching, and we'll see you guys on Wednesday.